Do a really good job of balancing all of his responsibilities. I'm really proud of him. I'm just acknowledging that caring for a baby can be all-consuming, Trina. <laughs> You're absolutely right. If you had told me a year ago that I would know how to comfort a colicky child, I would have laughed in your face. It's certainly a big challenge, and my father wasn't up to it, so I've assumed the responsibility. But yes, you're correct. It's a big commitment. Which makes it all the more impressive that Spencer is stepping up. Yes, absolutely. What you're doing, it's it's admirable. But do me a favor and and, and enjoy your youth while you can. <laughs> Balancing friends and activities, you know, while you're caring for a little one, it can be, it can be quite exhausting. No matter what your intentions are, I'll do my best. But one thing is for sure that I'll always make time for Trina. All right, I have to leave. Oh, well, thank you for coming. Thank you for having me. And thank you for coming. You earned major points with that gift. I like your family. They're good people. I'm not going anywhere. Except for daycare. Uh, what? Are you suggesting that I keep this from her? That kiss happened in a moment out of time. And that time is over. So let it go. I have. I'm everywhere and I know absolutely everything that's going on in my family and I definitely do not need to be brought up to speed by the hired help and just to put you on notice I will be counting the silverware that's not necessary why my family has a jewel thief in its employ is beyond me you'd be gone the minute you got arrested normally I would blame Monica, but I understand that the only reason you're still here is because you've got Mama Q wrapped around your little finger, and my son adores her. But that won't help you with me. Leave him alone, Granny. Uh. Leo got pretty shaky when he was talking about Ned's accident. He knows that he's unconscious. He's really worried. Well, thank you for telling me. And I'm glad he has you as a friend to count on. Well, I'm not doing much good if I go to jail. Yeah, it looks like my days are numbered. Let's just wait it out. Nina? Oh, so that's it, huh? You just... Given up? I I have the feeling that today will be the end of my engagement, so I want to make it a little easy for Sonny and leave the ring there. It's time for me to start letting go. Oh, honey. We stay with the girls. You don't even have to ask. Just feeling? Yeah, a Ava's with the girls. I I had to see you. What's wrong? <sighs> Where's your ring? Okay, Austin. Uh, Sunny is gone and the girls are asleep. So I have his apartment to myself until the nanny gets here, which could be any moment. So I have to be quick. If you were incriminating information that Mason wants, where would you hide? This is yours, but I want you to know that that I understand if you don't want to wait for me. That's not going to happen because this for me. I'm doing this for us. On the next General Hospital. That's how to bring that out of his twilight sleep. You do believe me, right? So all's well that ends well. Could it or would it? Sounds like a win today. There are other ways. That's a long way off in the future. Some things can't be forgiven.